Hello everyone, welcome to Tony Talks. Today I'm talking about 15 cancer symptoms to know. 15 cancer, cancer symptoms to know. Number one is change in your skin. A new spot on your skin or one of that changes sizes shape or color could be a sign of skin cancer another is a spot that doesn't look the same as it as all the other on your body your body if you have any unusual marks doctor check your skin they will do an exam <clears throat> and may remove a small piece called a biopsy another one is nagging cough if you don't smoke there is very little chance a nagging cough is a sign of cancer. Usually, it is caused by postnanza drip, asthma, acid reflux, or an infection. But if your if yours doesn't go away or you cough up blood, especially if you are a smoker, see your doctor. They may take smokers from your lungs or do a checked X-ray to check for lung cancer number two is breast changes most breast changes are not cancer it is still important though to tell your doctor about them and check them out let them know about any lumps nipple changes or discharge redness or thickening or pain in your breast they will do an exam and may suggest a mammogram. Then another one is bloating. You may have a full bloated feeling because of your diet or even stress. But if it doesn't get better or you also have fatigue, weight loss or back pain, have it check out. Constant bloating in women may be a sign of ovarian cancer. Your doctor can do a perfect exam to look for the cause. Another one is problems when you pee. Many men have urinary issues um, as they get older, like they need to go more often or leaks or a weak stream. Usually, these are signs of an enlarged or prostate, but they could also mean prostate cancer. See your doctor for an uh, exam and maybe special blood test called a PSA test. And another one is swollen lymph nodules. You have the small beam-shaped glands in your neck or armpits and uh, other places in your body. When they are swollen, it often means you are fighting an infection like a cold or strep throat. Some cancers like uh, lymphoma and leukemia can also cause this kind of swelling. Talk to your doctor to pinpoint the cause. Another one is blood when you use the bathroom. If you see blood in the toilet after you go, it is a good idea to talk to your doctor. Bloody stool is likely to come from swollen, inflamed veins called emeralds. But there is a chance it could be colon cancer. Blood in your pee could be a problem like a urinary tract infection, but it may be kidney or a bladder cancer as well. So let's let them check this out. Another one is testicle changes. If you notice a lump or swelling in your testicles, you need to see your doctor right away. A painless lump in, is the most common sign of testicular cancer. Sometimes, though, men may just have heavy feelings in their lower belly or scrotum or think their testicles feel larger, your doctor will do a physical exam of the area and may use an ultrasound scan to see if there is a tumor or another problem. Another one, another sign is trouble swallowing. The common cold, as a reflux, or even some medicine can make it hard to swallow once in a while. If it does not get better with time or with anticide, see your doctor. Trouble swallowing can be also a sign of cancer in your throat or the pipe between your mouth and stomach called the esophagus. Your doctor will do an exam and some tests like um, barium x-ray in which you swallow 
a chalky float to show your throat more clearly on the image. Another one is unusual vagina blade. Another one is unusual vagina bleeding. A bleeding that is not part of your usual period can have many causes, like fibroids or even sometimes uh, some types of bite control. But tell your doctor if you are bleeding between periods or after sex or have bloody discharge, or and they will want to rule out cancer of the uterus, cervix, or vagina. But be sure to let them know if you are bleeding after menopause that is not normal and uh, should be checked out right away another one is mouth issues from um, bad breaths to cancer sores most changes in your mouth are not serious but if you have white or red patches or sores in your mouth that does not heal after a couple of weeks especially if you smoke see your doctor it may be a sign of oral cancer other things to look for a lump in your cheek trouble moving your jaw or mouth pain you know another one is weight loss of course you can slim down when you change the way you eat or exercise it can also happen if you have other issues like stress or thyroid problem but it is not normal to lose 10 kilo or more without trying it's not possible there is a chance it could be a first sign of cancer of the pancreas or stomach or esophagus or lungs or other type of cancer so let it be checked out uh, another one is fever a fever isn't usually a bad thing sometimes it is just a sign that your body is fighting an infection uh, infection it can also be a side effect of some medicine but one that won't go away and doesn't have an obvious cause could be a sign of a blood cancer like leukemia or lymphoma. So please let us check out our bodies. Um, another one is heartburn or indigestion. Almost everyone has this bony feeling sometimes, you know, often because of their diet or stress. If lifestyle changes don't work and your uh, indigestion doesn't stop, your doctor may want to do some tests to look for a cause. It could be a sign of stomach cancer. And the last one here is fatigue. So a lot of things can make you very tired and most of them are not serious, but fatigue is um, one early signs of some cancers like leukemia, some colon and stomach cancer can cause blood loss that that you you can't see which can make you feel very tired if you are wiped out all the time and rest doesn't help talk to your doctor thank you please it is wealth don't take any small thing um on serious thank you so much for listening till i will see you in my next video stay safe stay blessed i love you all bye